From this video, you will get tips to prepare for the ServiceNow Certified Technical Architect CTA, exam. ServiceNow Certified Technical Architect CTA. Who should pursue the CTA certification? CTA program entry requirements. Key topics covered in the CTA exam. Tips to pass the ServiceNow CTA exam. 1. What is the main focus in the foundation stage of implementing the CSDM framework? A. Identifying and populating network infrastructure sys. B. Preparing accurate business information for reporting. C. Setting up relationships between technology and business. D. Working on CMDB tables associated with ITSM. Answer. C. 2. How are new classes of configuration items, sys, and relationships created in the ServiceNow CMDB? A. Importing data from external sources. B. Using predefined templates. C. Using integration hub ETL. D. Extending other classes. Answer. D. 3. What benefits does the Common Service Data Model, CSDM, provide to organizations using ServiceNow products? A. Rationalization, outage reduction, and business processes alignment. B. Improved security, increased storage capacity, and faster processing speed. C. Automated deployment maintenance efficiency, and comprehensive monitoring. D. Customization, consistent analysis, and data governance. Answer. D. 4. What action does the identification and reconciliation module perform to reduce duplicates in the CMDB? A merges duplicate records automatically. B. Uses identification rules to uniquely identify sys. C. Validates data sources to ensure accuracy. D. Assigns unique identifiers to each C. Answer. B. 5. Which methods can be used to populate the CMDB with data from third-party sources? Choose two answers. A. Identification and Reconciliation Engine, IR. B. Discovery. C. Integration Hub ETL. D. Service Graph Connectors. E. Service Mapping. Answer. CD. 6. What are the primary capabilities of service mapping in ServiceNow? Choose two answers. A. Create a service-centric configuration management database, CMDB. B. Enhance cybersecurity measures across systems. C. Automate routine IT infrastructure updates. D. Oversee software licensing for various platforms. E. Establish links between IT infrastructure components and application services. Answer. A. 7. A new project request requires quick implementation but involves portfolio realignment. As an IT leader, who should you consult to prioritize this demand? 
A. Demand Board B. Executive Steering Board C. Program Steering Committee D. Technical Governance Board Answer B. 8. A CTA is guiding a client through the final step of planning a ServiceNow integration. What critical aspect should the CTA prioritize when gathering technical details? A. Assessing network and system communication needs. B. Determining the color scheme for integration UI. C. Planning the communication for the integration go live. D. Estimating the projected integration data metrics. Answer. A. 9. A CTA is advising a large organization with multiple ServiceNow instances across different departments. The client wants to streamline their application deployment process and ensure consistency across instances. Which recommendation should the CTA prioritize regarding the application repository? A. Use it for a citizen development program. B. Employ it for real-time collaborative coding. C. Use it to centralize and distribute custom apps. D. Use it as a backup for all global application packages. Answer. C. 10. What is a core principle for data import in ServiceNow? A. Import data first and validate later. B. Use authoritative sources. C. Use ServiceNow as a data proxy. D. Schedule imports monthly. Answer. B. Subscribe and like pass question.